Corey Franklin to life in prison for stabbing his girlfriend to death. That means a 24-year-old Las Cruces must serve 30 years before he becomes eligible for parole. Our New Mexico Mobile Newsroom was inside the courtroom. ABC 7's Jamie Warren joined us live with the very latest. Jamie. Estella, it was an emotional day for the family of Graciela Hernandez today here in court. They tell me while it won't bring their beloved Gracie back, they're glad to finally put all of this behind them. And Franklin stood calmly before Judge Fernando Macias today here in court as he received his life sentence. Friends and family wearing shirts that read, in support of Gracie, sobbed. As we've reported, Franklin pleaded guilty Friday to first-degree murder. He stabbed his girlfriend, Hernandez, to death at the couple's home in 2014. Police reports say he stabbed Hernandez 11 times and beat her with a pot before going to buy beer. Franklin chose not to speak before his sentencing. I think that he was, he's very sensitive to offending um, any of the family that was in court today, and I think he just didn't... Um, feel comfortable saying anything at this time. We feel that justice has been served for her. Um, of course, it's not going to bring her back. It's not going to, but it at least gives us that comfort so we can deal and cope with it. I think it means a certain amount of relief, a certain amount of finality, a certain amount of uh, understanding that the system does work. And Franklin is also ordered to pay restitution, which covers counseling services, cost of the burial plot, as well as the cleanup for the murder scene. Reporting live from Doniana County District Court in Las Cruces with our New Mexico Mobile Newsroom, Jamie Warren, ABC 7. Okay, Jamie, thank you very much.